So here we have the Jivy E55 Maxia. This was from my FZ6. Of course, we have our side panniers here with some nice reflective tape. So as you can see, I've done a number of modifications, namely to the ergonomics and the comfort. I would say that everything I've been adding has uh, worked generally very, very, very well. Uh, very, very minor things that bother me on this motorcycle at this time, but I can live with them. And so you can see here, I've got also, uh, these are ADV highway pegs that mount onto this heed crash bar. We have all the factory accoutrements up here, but also we've added, of course, the lovely ram mount in the center, as well as a new Garmin GPS attached to our Madstad windscreen. And of course, another Jivy tank bag. This is a tank lock ring bag, so it just secures there nice and easily. Uh, of course, <laughs> I'm forgetting things already. We've added, of course, uh, I believe these are EvoTech brake and clutch levers. Up front, we have the Pyramid Plastics matching covers for the lights. Then along this side, we have our broken left indicator that snapped already on a cold day. Kind of unfortunate, but part of life. And other than that, we've done a couple of smaller things down here, which you probably can't quite tell. Let's see if I can get a shot of it. There. So down there we have our Soupy's lowering link, which is quite nice as well. Uh, we haven't actually lowered the bike. It's just still at the factory height. But what's nice about that is that it gives me the option to lower it a little bit to get a little more comfort when my wife is on the back and such. Uh, Pyramid Plastics, we have the Tire Hugger and Fenda Extenda. Those are not installed just yet, but they will be. And we also have a little rear mud guard there to, again, protect that shock. So the one last thing I will show is inside of our pannier bags. So our pannier bags, these are AliExpress pannier bags that, again, they hold up pretty well. What's nice about them is that there's plenty of room inside to store stuff and all your stuff doesn't just come tumbling out. Uh, the downside to this, I do like these pulls, by the way. The little pulls on this, they're very sturdy, they're well made. So the pulls on them work well, but then this whole pocket is sideways. So anything you store, you have to store it to the top side of all of this. So it's kind of unfortunate, but Again, it is additional little storage on the outside. Uh, I need to fix one of my pannier cases here eventually. As you try and at, as you try and turn the key, I can't turn it right. There's a, a fix on the forums. I plan to do a video on that separately. So until then, goodbye.